my loves. It's me, the baby voice. We're growing smarter. One book, one song, one rhyme at a time. This week's treasure reader is Micah. Micah read seven chapter books in one day. Yay, Micah! And if you want to be the treasure reader of the week, like. Subscribe and leave a comment below about your reading adventure, and it could be you. Does everybody know what time it is? Yes, you do. It's time to learn. Today we're learning about shapes. Shapes are everywhere. Why? Because everything is made up of shapes. This shape is called a sphere. Can you say sphere? A sphere is round and plump. It's not flat. Let's look at some examples of a sphere. I see a beach ball, a baseball, a golf ball, and a basketball. These are all examples of a sphere. This is a hexagon. Can you say hexagon? This is a flat shape with six points. Let's look at some examples of a hexagon. Here we have a honeycomb and a soccer ball. A honeycomb is where bees lay their eggs, and this is where you get that delicious honey. And what's so special about the soccer ball? It's a sphere. And it has hexagons on it. That's two shapes in one. This is a square. It's flat. It has four equal sides and four points. Let's look at some examples of a square. Do you see what I see? That's right. It's a window. Is your window the shape of a square? And then we have gift boxes. You can take a regular box and turn it into something beautiful, and then give it to someone. These boxes are the shape of a square. This is a rectangle. Does it look a little familiar to you? It's like a long square. It has four points and four sides, but all the sides are not the same. Let's look at some examples of a rectangle. I know you see these all the time. We have a cell phone and a door. What color is your door? These are a rectangle. This is my favorite shape. It's a heart. Can you say heart? It has two rounds that meet into two points. Let's look at some examples of a heart. Here we have heart balloons and heart sunglasses. If you want to show love, pass out some hearts. This is a circle. Can you say circle? It's flat and round, and it has no points. Let's look at some examples of a circle. Here we have a clock and a car tire. Do you know how to tell time? And do you have four of these on your car? These are the shape of a circle. This is a star. Can you say star? It has five points and it's flat. Do you look up at the sky to see the stars at night? Let's look at some examples of a star. Here we have a starfish, and then we have a star fruit. When you cut this fruit, it's in the shape of a star. This is a triangle. Can you say triangle? It has three points and three equal sides. Let's look at some examples of a triangle. Here we have pyramids. These are in Egypt. These pyramids have three equal sides and three equal points. 
And then we have a sailboat. And the sail on this boat is in the shape of a triangle. This is an oval. Can you say oval? An oval looks like a long circle. Let's look at some examples of an oval. Here we have three bird eggs. They're all in the shape of an oval. And we also have a hand mirror. Can you see your amazing self inside? This is an octagon. Can you say octagon? An octagon has eight points and eight equal sides. Let's look at some examples of an octagon. Here we have a stop sign. That's right, S-T-O-P spells stop. And we also have a poppet. Do you have this toy near you? These are some of the shapes that we see every day. Look out for them. So glad you came here today. We're here to celebrate you. Yay you. We'll see you learning.